The rather tiring thing about adulthood is its relentless repetition. Unfortunately, staying strong, organized, and on the ball is not a sporting competition for weekends or holidays, but has to be managed 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. There is no such thing as rest anymore. For many people, it simply means blocking out the thousand things that actually need to be done at the last minute. When our schedules, the children's timetables, and all kinds of leisure activities are tugging at us at the same time and trying to make themselves heard, we can find ourselves running very short of energy. But that is only the beginning. There is also a burnout on life. This encompasses our entire existence, our everyday life, our partnership, family, job, and of course, our relationship with ourselves. We can get really exhausted from all of this at some point. In today's video, we will show you how you can recognize when your life is on the brink of burnout. If you like our videos, feel free to support us with a thumbs up, subscribe to Psychology in Mind, activate the bell for notifications, and get excited for new videos uploaded every day. Number 1. You turn night into day. Insomnia is always an alarm signal. Our body knows its sleep cycle by heart. That's why, ideally, we don't need to depend on a clock or an alarm clock. Chronic exhaustion, on the other hand, is clearly recognizable by the fact that sleep is impossible. And if we do manage to sleep, it will not be restful in any way. We are just as tired and worn out as before. Number 2. Nothing gives you pleasure anymore Joy is the brilliant spark in our lives that allows us to be really and truly alive. It is only through joy that we sense who we are and are able to enjoy every moment. But if there is nothing left to make us smile, or at least brighten our day a little, we need to be on high alert. Such a gloomy and listless view of life sounds very much like depression is brewing on the horizon. Number 3. Every little thing makes you angry. If our patience is extremely short and our nerves are constantly on the verge of being stretched to the limit, our unfortunate friends and family will be the first to recognize that we are out of balance and out of sorts. A content and vital person shoulders a certain amount of troubles with ease. But if everything suddenly becomes too much for us to bear, we have gone well beyond the point where we could still take corrective action with a rest or a spa day. Number 4. You avoid everyone around you We also know this is one of the symptoms of depression. Withdrawal from the world is necessary at a certain level of exhaustion because we simply can no longer cope with the overstimulation, the many well-intentioned pieces of advice, and the countless stories that keep nagging at us. However, we are beginning a grim cycle here that can turn into a downward spiral. We desperately need social contacts in times of pessimism and hopelessness. Number 5. Motivation is a thing of the past. When we are at the end of our rope, Everything is too tedious and too difficult for us. We just manage to get through the most essential tasks, but we no longer feel any drive. We lack joy and a sense of purpose. As if in a trance, we go about our daily lives, but we no longer have any ambition. Starting new projects or even trying something new seems impossible. Number 6. You can't think straight anymore. Your head starts buzzing like a beehive when you're on the verge of exhaustion. You are constantly thinking of 100 different tasks at the same time. But in the end, you don't manage to do any of them. Your guilt is getting in the way. As always, your inner critic is of no help either. You try to remember the most important things, to not lose the big picture. But that's exactly what happens most of the time. A complete system failure will not be avoided for much longer on this downward spiral. Number 7. Anxiety and panic dominate your everyday life 
We notice it, of course, when things start to slip away from us. When every day begins and ends in chaos, it doesn't take a genius to notice the looming loss of control. As always, when we're in stress mode, our bodies react with panic and first release a good amount of cortisol and adrenaline. Our heart rate increases, our pulse races. If these states of emergency, which are equally stressful for the mind and body, accumulate, panic attacks and oppressive anxiety can be the result. Number 8. Your passion is long gone. Like a salutation from days long gone or sheer mockery, that's exactly what passion or enthusiasm sounds like to burnt out ears. Most of the time, in a state of total exhaustion, we can't remember at all what excitement and burning desire used to feel like. Where once we had a great purpose and a mission in mind, today there is only a black hole. Meaninglessness and complete apathy have taken their place. Number 9. Emotional or spiritual bond no longer exists. With increasing exhaustion and despondency, the emptiness inside us is also expressed on the surface. Nothing and no one is important or can contribute to making us feel better. As a result, we isolate ourselves even more from the world. We feel lonely, but also no longer look for friends. We feel misunderstood and left alone. But it is we who isolate ourselves and feel detached. Number 10. You feel constantly exhausted. It can be obvious to some, but being on the verge of a breakdown feels like a heavy load that someone has put on us. All of our movements strain us or even hurt us. We experience each day as if in a trance, and we act as if we are wrapped in wool. Chronic exhaustion is just that, being drained at the end of one's rope, discouraged, depressed, and without any prospect of improvement. Today's conclusion, are you content or is there room for improvement? If you recognize yourself in just a few of these 10 symptoms, pull the emergency brake. At this point, no amount of time off or power naps will help. You need a break from everyday life and no one can give it to you but yourself. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Did you find this information helpful? Do you have experience with it? We would love to hear from you. Leave a comment below and let us know your thoughts. For more resources about mental health, self-improvement, and psychology, visit our website. You'll find the link in the video description where you can also connect with us on social media and sign up for our email list. Take care of yourself and have a beautiful day.